Let's go on an adventure, everybody, with these event-exclusive SH Figure Arts Funimation and Bandai Tamashii Nation's Son Goku and Bulma from the Dragon Ball series. One of the greatest series that I ever watched as a kid, and having these two best friends in plastic form is a dream come true, because Dragon Ball was a very special anime that I watched as a kid. So let's take a look at Kid Goku, because here we got him, big head and all, showcasing exactly how cool he is. First and foremost, you gotta understand, you gotta be 15 to own this toy. There are intricate instructions for his power pole and sheath, as well as a lot of different faces and hands. This little Goku toy comes with a lot of dynamic action. And with that, it makes sense, because looking cartoony with all its hands, the different faces, the four-star Dragon Ball, the power pole, and two sets of tails. I mean, we're looking at a little cartoonish monkey boy alien man who's ready to showcase why he's the best. And God, he comes even with the spare opening to put on the actual Saiyan tail. You can take off the head so you can actually bring in the sheath for the power pole. And ultimately, he looks great in that blue gi. It's, it's something straight out of the comics, something straight out of the anime. And animated he is because his articulation is on par with some of the best toys I've ever played with. The fact that he's tiny doesn't really deter from the fact that he can bust all kinds of moves. With that, he's also got his additional faces, so you can put him in all kinds of fun poses. And that's the purpose of this. Because ultimately, Goku is here to showcase why he's the best, and the living embodiment of what joy looks like. And of course he's happy, because his childhood best friend Bulma is also here. And God, her instruction manual is just as intricate as his. She comes with all kinds of different hands, as well as a gun, a gun holster. I mean, she's ready for an adventure with her Dragon Radar and Two Star Dragon Ball. And this Bulma is based off of her initial appearance, with her braided ponytail and the red ribbon, wearing her very short pink dress with her name on it, the blue sneakers, and cute purple socks. I mean, we're looking at that iconic look, the great scientist, the great adventurer, Bulma Briefs. And then besides being anime accurate, she also has all of this fantastic articulation in the neck, in the arms, even the ponytail moves. I mean, we're talking about a figure that has complete movement in so many different ways. And I think that's really important so that she can kick ass and do all the things she needs to do. Once you pull the head apart, even though it's a bit terrifying, she does come with three faces to show her full range of emotions. And I think that's important for better storytelling. And make no mistake, pay your respects to Bulma, because she's one of the greatest female characters of all time. Because Bulma's so much more than a cute face. She's got a gun, and she knows how to use it. She looks great next to my wild rider suit Bulma, and ultimately, let's see what kind of adventures we can get into. Because it's all about the Dragon Balls, and that's what brings Bulma and Goku together. These two kids that ultimately end up going into all kinds of shenanigans, for better or for worse, to really develop a strong kinship. A relationship built off of them going off of adventure, taking on crazy monsters, and showcasing a sense of true spirit. I mean, we're looking at two best friends here, two amazing characters that we've grown up with. And seeing them grow up in these moments is something that's truly heartfelt. So I'm so excited to have both of them in the collection to retell some of my favorite stories.